In this tutorial, I'm going to show you how to give a developer access to your PayPal account, or at least the components of the PayPal account that they need to do an integration between PayPal and your website. So here we go. The first thing you're going to do is you're going to log in. And once you log in, you're going to come up here to this little gear icon on the top right, click that, and go into Account Settings. And once you're in Account Settings, you're going to go right in the dead center under Account Access. You're going to go to Manage Users, click Update, and then Add User, this little button here at the top right. Click that, and you can enter their name and details. This Login User, uh, user lo the Create User ID, this is going to be their username. So whatever you type here is what they're going to use to log into the account. They won't use their email address. So just keep that in mind. And when you do this, by the way, document as you go the username and the password, put it in a uh, safe and secure spot uh, for easy uh, communication later so that you don't forget it or lose it out of memory. Otherwise, you have to go through the process again. So let's go through this. Okay, I've got it all put in there. Remember, this is the, uh, the uh, user ID test 2 ADV is the one I've used. I'm going to click continue. And now you get to choose what their permissions are. And the only ones they really need are, if you scroll right to the bottom, you'll see integration right there and maybe marketing. If you give them those two, that ought to be adequate. And you can always change this later. But uh, those two, this one in particular, give them API access for the integrations. And click continue. And you're done. And when they go to log in, you can just supply them with that username you chose and the password, and they can just log in at the normal PayPal, um, using the normal PayPal login link. And you're all set.